Hey YouTube, it's me guys, Zavadar here. How are you guys doing today? Today, bringing us another fantastic Battlefront video, and this time we're talking about an update that will be coming on probably Monday, June 27th. That's what they're guessing. Uh, they're aiming for it, and uh, therefore, that's probably going to happen. So, this uh, patch note update list uh, is going to be in the description below. If you guys miss any of it, you guys can go ahead and check that out. Uh, but basically, all of this is relating to the Bestman DLC. So let's start right off. Uh, they mentioned in the lobby, no more players will get stuck in the lobby uh, or unable to join due to teams being unbalanced. So basically, if uh, there's more than two players on one side, then some players might get left out and some players might get stuck on the screen and whatnot and might have to restart the console. Very annoying. I think it's happened to me once, maybe twice, but still, very good fix. Uh, so there's a couple of he heroes versus villains uh, um, bug fixes. Uh, just about, you know, invisible UI and uh, joining lobbies and all that good stuff. Uh, and also, there was a kind of glitch with the game mode where if a uh, hero falls due to someone quitting, the whole game would kind of just hang around and not really work out so well. Um, I know there's other glitches within Heroes vs. Villains. I know there's videos of Darth Vader joining the heroes and vice versa and whatnot. And uh, I'm sure those bugs will be fixed very, very soon. Speaking about heroes, Dengar will no longer do insane damage to Luke Skywalker. Uh, with his explosive rush and hurricane strike uh, attacks, those are just crazy lethal, especially against Luke Skywalker. That's not only for heroes versus villains, but also if you're playing any other game mode and Dengar happens to come in. So, a uh, major flaw there will be fixed, um, and uh, that's all good. So, also, in the pre-round timer, um, we have 30 seconds before every game. Now that's adjusted to 60 seconds. So if you have to go get a drink to get some food, to you know, adjust your music maybe, uh, you can go ahead and do that. You have a good minute to uh, go ahead and do that. So, uh, also, ATAT -AT health decrease on Cloud City if you're playing the Assault, uh, sorry, Walker Assault. Um, so that's always a good thing to, uh, you know, adjust to make sure it's even. Otherwise, the Empire has a very strong advantage as it's only one at, -AT that is just overpowered. Especially with Cloud City where there's, you know, not that many lines of sight to see the at, -AT. You know, having that have a lot of health is kind of unfair to the Rebels. Um, but also, they're changing the frequency of game modes. Uh, so... Uh, and also game maps as well. So first game modes. So two rounds of sabotage will now be played every other round. So it's very similar to uh, the game mode extinction. Sorry, extraction on outer rim. Uh, they increase the frequency of the carbon freezing chamber, and uh, they have decreased the frequency of the level cloud city. So I know I've been playing nothing but the Bestman DLC for the past couple days. And uh, that Cloud City map keeps on appearing, which is not a problem. I like the map a lot. It's a really cool. Uh, but like I said, with the Walker Assault, kind of, kind of got annoying. But anyway, the uh, Carbon Freezing Chamber, I have played that probably a fraction of the time. And when I have, it's only been the Sabotage game mode. So I'm very happy to see that uh, be increased and the Cloud City decreased a little bit. Again, great maps, great DLC. If you guys haven't downloaded it already, I highly recommend it. It adds a huge new spice to the game. And uh, yeah, so guys, this uh, update apparently will go live Monday. Again, no promises, although if everything goes right, Monday is the release date for this. So, top box is the previous video, which actually is a Bespin DLC video. Bottom box is a mystery video, like always. I'll see you guys later. Peace out, have a great day, and let the force be with you, always.